morning guys welcome back to the channel in today's video our dad's painting our uncle dave's roof on his classic mini so it turns out that i am making a video today um i wasn't going to make a video today but i've been told we're making a video today as you can tell by the intro <laughs> uh, i'm just getting ready doing a mini roof it's already prepped uh there's a couple of little stone chips in it and um he wants it black instead of white so run my old workshop and all i've got to do is give it another little wipe down and start getting some color on it the roof is exceptionally straight there's sort of no dents or dings in it that we could see uh known our luck there'll probably be something in it once we put gloss black on it but we went over it last night i got him to double check it uh yeah literally everything else should be sweet so you're getting a little video today I'm doing a mini roof yeah hopefully come out quite nice uh yeah not really fit for painting again in here i've got no filters so i'm not even going to close the shutter uh, we're just going to make do, crack on, it's better than doing it outside. So, uh, yeah, let me get cleaning and we'll get some paint on. Uh, yeah, and you can have a little watch, see you in a bit. This is the problem with painting old stuff. Loads of like silicony type stuff coming up. This is the second dust over of a little bit of base. I always dust it first with solvent on old cars. Just to make sure well, that didn't sort of come up. There were some weird things that come up in the first sort of dust over. And still showing a bit of a weird scratchy bit so I'm gonna to have to flat that down like that so I'm let that dry off a little bit more and then I'll nib this lock down and then see how we get on <laughs> the joys lots of this stuff we managed to sort the silicones out and the bits and bobs literally dust it on drying it dusting it on drying it so i'm going to tack that off in a mo and then i can get a couple of normal coats on now that should have held it all back always a nightmare but we didn't prime it uh and we're trying to do it as cheap as possible so it's just like look we just sand it down and blast it and it's kind of what happens really if you sealed it all in it would have been fine but God knows what paint's on there and how many times it's been painted. So I'm going to give it another five and we'll tack it off and then uh, I'll start putting another couple of normal coats on. We should be all right, should have held, should have held it back. So uh, yeah, see you in a moment.
then what we have here is a case of F you Dave, shove it up your Jaxi Dave, have your piece of put back Dave. <laughs> it's got to sand it all off. Silicon central everywhere, it won't have none of it. I managed to hold it back when I dusted it on, but when I put a proper coat on, game over, you can't really see this in here. Very difficult to show. Silicon massive. The joys of painting old foot. So I'm now going to sand it all off and we shall seal it with some epoxy or some form of sealer. I've got like a barcoaty type one. I don't really like using that. Hi. So let's crack on. See you in a moment. What's the first rule of business? What's the second rule of business? Six rules. Well said. Never do cheap love jobs for your pals because it always goes wrong. <laughs> Let's get sanded. This is going to take ages. I'll come back to you in a bit. I'm having to use 180 grit. It's all balling up. It's obviously wet up what's underneath. See when I got it all off. Well, that was emotional. So it must have wet up all the old paint underneath. <sighs> what a nightmare. So, I'm going to have to seal it in, so I'm going to use some epoxy primer. Some Novo Protect 360, any corrosion as well. Uh, you can use that as a wet on wet. So I'm going to smash some of that on and then I might put some eye build on it, dry that, block that down and then paint. So let's crack on, <laughs> see you in a bit. with a bit of epoxy on let that dry off I, uh, a little bit of a run there but I'm actually going to let this dry and then I'm going to um, probably put some eye build on it and go from there but that sealed it there's no silicones, there's no crap that's looking alright now so see you when that's dry is ticking time for the weekend work is coming to an end i got my eyes wide open savor in the moment trying to breathe it all in if i could slow down the clock i would when i'm with you i just feel so good i'd have every play every single night that's the primer done it's all held back. It's all sanded down, ready to rumble. Just got to tack it off, get some paint smashed on it. See you in a moment.
Right. Time for some clear coat. My great lighting conditions. <laughs> Three there, one there. Can't see sod all. Wet the floor down, cleaned up a little. Got no filters to go in there, so this is the best we can do. All right, let's do this. Some flies going around in here. Hopefully they don't land in it. try it with the extractor off for this last coat then we'll turn it on to suck the fumes out after to see if we can get it any cleaner that is not looking great let's go Get this dried. We're trying to get it dried. The infrared lamps don't quite reach over. 
Um, there's no point trying to show you in here because I can't even see. Um, yeah, get it dried off. I pulled a sheet off and we'll open the shutter up. There we go, she's out. There's definitely some trash in it, but uh, let me polish it up. And it's like a trim thing that goes all the way around the roof as well. This is not the best environment to be sucking in. He does sand and gravel and all that in there now. Thunder trunk there. There's quite a few little bits, but I mean, once it's flat and polished, it'll be, uh, be really nice. I slowed down a bit, tried to lay down a bit more clear so we can uh, polish it up nice. That's what he wanted. Gloss black. Quite a cool little mini. This is really clean, this is. Um, Needs a couple of little bits doing, but uh, he's been slowly buying bits for it and pimping it up. A few more bits in there to sort out. That'll do. I don't think I'm going to uh, flat and polish that today. I'm going to go home and chill. I've had enough. <laughs> you want to be black? It's black. Yeah, I've really got to sort this out in here if I am going to do anything else in here. Well, I ain't. I don't want to do anything else in here. But one light there and three lights there is no good. Can't see nothing. And now this geezer does gravel and sand and all that out there. It's, I mean, it was always dusty up here anyway. Um, obviously, it don't help that I ain't got any filters in. If I did have filters in, it would probably have been a lot better. But yeah, it is what it is. And it's better than doing that outside. There's no way I wanted to do that outside. So, there we have it. That is it from me today. You weren't getting a video, but you got a video. So enjoy. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. As always, massive thanks for watching, and we'll see you very soon in the next one. Stay safe and be lucky.